a favorite shot of that? Man, she's yeah, searching the cash. No, 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 it's okay. Dirty to touch no, 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 it's okay. Morning, Anna. Morning. Yes, I was confused when I saw everybody here. I, I, I did everybody not get the memo, so I went over there and then came back to figure out what was going on and told you came and told us. Uh, yeah, so I was trying to figure out what was going on. No. Oh, what do we want to talk about? Talk about his legacy and what he did for hip hop and you know, things like that. Curtis, you the you the reporter. I don't know. I'm gonna ask you the question. Curtis, so Curtis yeah, I like turn the, towards me a little. There you go. I like. The, Here we go. Go go at it. You know. Here we go. It's okay. I mean, walk a little bit. Okay. Okay. I lost sight. another notch under the belt. Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you. Yo, give me some work. Hey, yeah, we out here, you know, stand representing the cops and Dr. Drake getting started. Move for the ground, move for the ground. See, I'm throwing this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's get the ball on it. Yes, it's good. Yes, Check one, two, check one, two. Hey, 
Jimmy Iovine and Dre established Beats Electronics in 2006 and later launched Beats Music and Apple acquired both in 2014. In 2017, HBO released a four-part documentary, The Defiant Ones, chronicling the life of and the relationship of Iovine, Jimmy Iovine, and Dr. Dre throughout the years and how they shaped some of the more exciting moments in pop culture. Among many other accolades, Dr. Dre won a Grammy and an Emmy for the Defiant Ones. In 2013, the USC Jimmy Iovine and Andre Young Academy for Arts, Technology, and the Business of Innovation was funded and established. In 2022, they expanded their efforts to the Los Angeles Unified School District, opening the Iovine and Young Center Integrated Design, Technology, and Entrepreneurship Magnet a new high school that will offer students grounding that's getting their grind on in that same cutting edge curriculum. Dr. Dre donated $10 million to Compton High School for the school's new performing arts center which broke ground in 2022. The facility is named Andre, Dr. Dre Young Performing Arts. In 2022, Dr. Dre collaborated with Snoop Dogg, Mary J. Blige, 50 Cent, Eminem, and Kendrick Lamar. And we all bear witness to that Pepsi Super Bowl 56 halftime show at SoFi. That Super Bowl performance took home three Emmys, including a win for Outstanding Variety Special, the only time a Super Bowl halftime show has won an Emmy in that category. Last year, the Recording Academy and Black Music Collective created the inaugural Dr. Dre Global Impact Award to celebrate his trailblazing achievements in music. This past February, Dr. Dre and Snoop Dogg launched, launched Gin and Juice by Dr. Dre and Snoop, the first ready-to-drink product from the new premium spirits company. These partners, they've been, man, they've had their stars aligned for many, many years. And speaking of being stars that align, they got their stars right next to each other. The collaborations continue. Ladies and gentlemen, it's about that time to bring up our honoree. Coming to the stage, please help me welcome Dr. Dre. One more time for Dr. Dre. We have two good friends of Dr. Dre's, ladies and gentlemen, and your friends would like to say a few words for you, Dre. Our first speaker is record producer, our first speaker is record label founder and entrepreneur. Please welcome the best of the best to the stage, ladies and gentlemen, Jimmy IV. Four guys together. Makes me a little misty. Also, it reminds me of my past when I got abject fear. But um, it was an amazing time in my life, and to see them all together is just an incredible moment. So they only gave me two minutes. I could do two minutes on the first minute I met Dr. Dre. You know, but what you hear all the time in different parts of the entertainment business, like basketball, is it LeBron or is it Michael? As a producer of hip hop, you never hear Dr. Dre or it's only Dr. Dre. Even the other producers say it's Dr. Dre. In the 50 years of hip hop, Dr. Dre is the greatest producer ever. Producer 
producer of all time. What took them so long? And I heard he, I heard some of the other music he's making right now. He's coming for other genres. What I can say about Dre is he's the greatest partner, friend, ally you could possibly have. For all you people out there that are aspiring to get into entertainment, when you go to bed tonight, pray you meet a Dr. Dre. Congratulations, Dre, on the Hall of Fame. Man, you deserve an entire neighborhood. It's time to unveil that star. Dr. Dre, if you walk down with me, my brother, you haven't seen this at all, right? Go ahead now, Harry O, what up, bro? I see you, brother. Alchemist, hello. Hello! Hey, Snoop Dogg, hey, Snoop Snoop Dogg, hey, 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 Snoop Dogg, That was a good album. Though.